It's not Black Friday, but it's close. Back to school selling season, as we call it, is actually the second largest retail selling season right behind holiday. Julie Sanderson of the Franklin Park Mall says the shopping center is expecting big crowds from now through the beginning of the school year, and parents can expect to pay big bucks. The National Retail Federation says parents will spend on average about $350 on clothing and shoes. That's on top of school supplies and fees. Huntington Bank estimates parents will spend between $600 and $1,400 per student, depending on their age. The price per high school student expected to be up 9%. I can't believe it's only 9% more because it's every year it gets a little bit more and more and more. Um, laptops, you know, every year they progress in technology, so we have to keep up and get her everything she needs. Jamie Ingstrom has four school age kids in her household, three in elementary school and a senior in high school. For the first time ever in Ohio, parents will get a tax break on back to school items. The sales tax holiday starts Friday and runs through the weekend. Supplies and instructional materials, as well as clothing up to $75 per item, will be tax free during that time. It's going to be excellent for everybody and even the residual for folks who don't have product that's associated with the back to school selling. I think it's a great idea. I just think it's going to be quite busy. Um, we're actually avoiding it and doing it ahead of time. <laughs>